What's going on everyone? Welcome to another video on the Foxtag YouTube channel. Foxtag has been providing you with tutorials literally for years and this one for today is going to be about volume on iPhone. More specifically, how to disable automatic volume lowering on an iPhone. Well, the topic is kind of interesting because your iPhone will never on its own just lower the volume. In case you play some kind of music, you can see you can adjust the volume from the control center or from the buttons here. And when you do that, your iPhone is just not gonna lower it by chance. It just doesn't happen randomly like that. But what I believe that you are referring to when you say automatic volume lowering is whenever you, for example, receive a phone call. You probably have noticed that you can, for example, have a phone call received receiving going on, your iPhone is ringing at a certain level of volume, but when you, for example, look at it or pick it up or after some time, it just gets lower, the volume gets lower for some reason. And this is what I'm going to be talking about today. Because believe it or not, it's actually a feature and it's a useful one. So if you open up these settings and you don't even go to these sounds and haptics, but you scroll all the way down to the face ID and passcode. When you open it up, you need to authenticate yourself with the passcode. So I'm going to get inside and you can see your basic face ID settings for iPhone unlocking and other apps, all the stuff in here. You can reset it. But if you scroll down a bit more, you can see the attention section. So you can see attention, require attention for face ID. That's okay. But there are also attention aware features, which I have turned on. You can see the little description says that iPhone will check for attention before dimming the display, expanding a notification when locked, or lowering the volume of some alerts. So this feature is actually behind the lowering of the volume on your iPhone. When that, when it does automatically, this feature is behind it. By the way, guys, if you want to know everything about your iPhone apps, you have to click the link down below in the description. It's a 100% free education platform where I publish like video editing courses. There is going to be the all apps explained course, which is coming up. It's going to explain every single app on your iPhone. It's going to be really cool. So go ahead and check out that link. It's free to access. So yeah, go ahead and do that right now. So you can turn it off if you don't want to care about it or you just don't want to uh, come across this thing anymore. But if you want to understand the feature, it's basically very useful, I would say, because when you have it turned on your, for example, iPhone is going to start ringing now. Somebody's going to call me. So iPhone is going to start to ring at a very loud volume much louder than usual, of course. So yeah, I mean, the, the normal volume that I set for my ringer. However, once the iPhone notices through Face ID that I have checked the phone, it doesn't have to ring so loud anymore. It can lower the volume, so it still rings, but it doesn't have to be that loud because I, the owner of the iPhone, have noticed that it's ringing. So it's not that important for me to, to actually hear it that loud anymore. So it's actually a good feature. I quite like it. But if you don't want to use it, of course, disable it on your iPhone and you're going to be fine. Naturally, this only applies to iPhones with Face ID. So, you know, the older iPhones with the, of course, the home button, they don't really work that way, obviously, but it's not really an issue, of course, because most iPhones have Face ID nowadays. So I'm going to wrap up this video right now. I explained everything what I wanted to I wanted to explain to you in this video. Hope you found it useful. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up under it, but definitely subscribe down below so you never miss future tutorials and videos like this one. Thanks all for watching. See you guys later. Peace out until then.